welcome back to a new video today we're gonna do another coffee talk i feel we really need to catch up have a little bit of a chat i sometimes joke that coffee talks for me are almost a little bit like therapy where i just get my thoughts out and like update all of you guys i don't know the weird thing is like i don't have a lot of thoughts right now but i have so many feelings we just came back from our trip in japan which was absolutely amazing it was so fun to go around japan with our whole team to capture a lot of content to visit our matcha farm for the first time was really really special to like meet the farmers we came back a couple days ago and i don't know what it is but ever since i got back i just have this like very anxious feeling i don't know if it's because i have to like be caught up on a lot of work and like wedding planning and just i don't know maybe it's because the holidays are around the corner i don't know why but i just like feel this like pressure in my chest and just like this kind of restlessness i don't know i'm still trying to kind of identify what it is and i'm just like trying to tell myself to that sometimes it's completely okay to like feel those type of things and not everything has to if you really have a reason so i'm just trying to like accept it feel it and just move on i guess i'm gonna just finish up my makeup i got this cute little sweater from rent a runway i've been really loving rent a runway so basically run the runway is an app where you can just like rent clothing <laughs> every month you can pick a couple new items and like i thought the sweater was like really really cute i think it's from maple or something i'm also still like unpacking and maybe that gives me anxiety as well i hate packing unpacking all of it but i guess that's what comes with travel can't have it all also i bought myself a little present in tokyo and i actually want to show you guys quickly i got not one but i got two bags from bottega and i'm actually Let's unbox them here. So basically the currency rate from the Japanese yen to the US dollar was absolutely insane. And everything was like 30% cheaper. So we're on the airport where it's tax-free and it was so much cheaper. I was like, okay, I just like have to take this chance and like get a new bag. I don't know if you follow me on TikTok where I already did an unboxing video. If you don't, you should at Sana. But the first one is this gorgeous gorgeous bag. The letter from Bottega Veneta is just next level and this is the inside. I really really love it. It's like a crossbody so I can put my vlog camera in here, my film camera, all of it. I think it's super cute. And then I also got another one which is bigger for like travel and whenever I want to carry a lot of stuff. It's just this white one. I have it in like a mini and it has this like slouchy feel to it i absolutely love it spoil me <laughs> no we did a lot of really really hard work in japan so like after i was like okay spoil myself this is my christmas present i guess we don't really do my family and i don't really do like really big christmas presents and things like that it's not really a thing so that's why i was like you know what i'm gonna do it for myself anyway before i'm going downstairs and make a little matcha and drink before we're going to chat i'm going to do a little bit of meditation i've shared this tool before my sensei device i put this on my chest and i swear it gets rid of all this tension that i'm holding here and whatever i'm feeling anxious like right now so i'm going to do a session and then we will make a little cozy warm cup of matcha Through Bluetooth and my phone, I can connect the Sensei device. Once the session starts, it will slightly vibrate and I'm able to adjust volume and intensity. You place the Sensei on your chest and the sound waves are synchronized with the soundscape in the app and give you a feeling of deep relaxation. My favorite part is the vibration because it calms down your nervous system and I feel it reduces my anxiety and stress instantly. Sometimes I use it right before bed if I have trouble sleeping or throughout the day whenever I feel anxious. I have a very special code for you. You can use code SANA for $30 off. I will link it in the description down below. It's available worldwide. The 
Okay, I honestly feel like 10 pounds lighter. <laughs> I just, I don't know, took a little moment, really zoned out, and my body just feels so much more relaxed. It's honestly amazing. But yeah, I am going to make a pumpkin spice matcha for today. Before the event last time, Jesse made this like. Made this like recipe with matcha and pumpkin spice and it actually pairs really well together. Fall was here, so I thought why not do kind of like a holiday type of drink. I am going to use some oat milk for this. As you guys know, I like to pair my matcha, if I pair it with milk, always with oat milk. For some reason, other types of milk, I don't really think it's really tasty. So yeah, I'm gonna show you how to do the recipe. I was going to make a hot drink, but I changed my mind in the middle of it. This is an iced pumpkin spice matcha, but obviously you can make this hot as well. I'm very excited to try it. Okay, if you want to switch it up and have maybe a little bit of a sweeter version of a matcha, it's almost like a little treat. This is absolutely delicious. I actually might like it better than like a pumpkin spice latte or something. Also, especially when I feel very anxious, I am trying to like <laughs> really avoid coffee because it's only like making it worse while matcha kind of like you know calms you down also you saw in the video that i was using my bowl and i know a lot of people do holiday presents and gifts shopping like really early at nekohama we made this super cute bamboo kit and it's amazing for like presents and in the kit it has a full set. It has the bowl in there, it has the whisk in there, the spoon, it has matcha in it. You can also use the little tray or lid as a little tray, which is super, super cute and really amazing for like the holiday season. I'm going to link it in the description down below. You can go check it out. They're available on our website and they ship worldwide. So definitely go check this out. Guys, this is my new favorite drink. That's so, so good. Alrighty, let's chat. I don't know why, but whenever I feel I want to have like an intimate conversation, I always come upstairs. I do the same with phone calls. And I don't know if it's because it's a smaller room, I feel like more safe. Even though whenever I post a video, it goes out to thousands of people, but I don't really like notice that as much. And this, by the way, might be my new favorite drink. It's really good. Anyway, let's fill you all in in all the life updates so a couple days ago we came back from japan and the trip was absolutely amazing it was so great to be able to see our actual nekohama farms meet the farmers and really see how it goes from a green tea leaf into your cup and now we have so much better understanding of like why this is such high quality why it has no bitter taste the amount of care and different steps goes into it like it was really really eye-opening like we already knew this was the freaking best but that just like double confirmed it and someone asked me yesterday what my favorite part of the trip was and i would say going to the farms and then also the meetup we did in Tokyo. That was so incredible, like how many people showed up there. Also many of you and I just wanted to say again like a big thank you. And it just also made me realize that I was like, wow, we've built such a big community over the last few years, all interested in like health and wellness and like well-being and lifestyle. And I was like, this is so awesome that we can like all support one and each other here. And in a way, it gave me also a lot of like motivation again. Whenever I'm like constantly talking to the camera, like I get sometimes in these creative ruts and like a moment like that just 
that's what I do it for. Like it's just so eye-opening for me. I just gives me so much energy and I'm like, wow, this is just incredible. So I definitely think we should do this in some other countries as well, maybe in the Netherlands, LA, New York, whatever, like do more of these like meetups because it was just amazing. And then yeah, since whenever I came back, I definitely feel a little bit this pressure and I started like thinking about like where is this pressure coming from like I literally feel it in my body obviously I feel it on my chest but I also just feel it in my head and I'm like I am putting so much pressure on myself for nothing I don't know I feel everything just flows so much better if I don't feel that pressure and I'm like why do I keep putting that pressure back on myself? I don't know, this is like a constant freaking battle. It's just like, I wanna do things good and right. And like, I don't know if I'm like trying, I, I'm not trying to prove to anyone. I'm just like trying to prove to myself, I guess. And I like, I can't find the underlining reason for that. I do a lot of like sessions with Jason and this is actually something I need to bring up more i like love what i do and i focus on a lot of different projects between like modeling and like you know social media content creation Oklahoma and soul sync body and then hopefully soul sync kitchen this year i'm working very busy on a lot of recipes is this like a thing in focus i'm not so confusing okay my camera is literally overheating i don't know what's wrong with it it does it lately a lot actually so i just keep filming on my um uh, on my phone anyway uh where was i oh yeah on top of everything i'm also planning a wedding and it was kind of on hold for a little bit not the actual wedding but the planning of it because we were traveling and all of that and i picked it up back this weekend i actually find it really fun but it's like a lot and a lot of people actually you know warn where they're like oh my god planning the wedding is so stressful and i'm like where's the stressful part coming in like where do I need to be mentally prepared because so far it's been like pretty smooth we've gone through like the flowers the venue I'm working on music now so I'm like where does it become stressful so yeah that's kind of uh what I'm up to I'm this week also going to try on a wedding dress for the first time I don't know we shall see maybe I find something maybe not I will actually do a vlog about this too with like the whole wedding series so yeah this was a little bit of an update also for a sign off i also wanted to make you aware of a black friday sale what is going on on soul sync body i offer now a yearly membership for only 99 dollars, which means it's less than nine dollars a month to be able to do all the fitness workouts to do strength workouts pilates workouts at home and i promise you it's gonna make you feel so so much better you can also purchase it as a gift so you can gift it also for other people i'm going to put that link in the description down below as well so you can go check it out and then don't forget to subscribe to the channel and i will see you guys very soon